What's up guys? So today I'm going to be installing and uh, test shooting the Poseidon Super Recoil Spring made for WE rifles. It doesn't fit in all rifles, so I will tell you which ones they work in specifically. In this video, we're going to be installing it on my WE ACR or MSK, Masada, whatever you want to call it. But it also does fit in WE SCAR L's, MP5 series, the G36, the SVD. And I'm pretty sure I'm forgetting a few other ones, but I'll, I'll tell you what they are. Here's the packaging. Like I said, the ACR, the SCAR L, the MP5, the G36, SVD, Sniper, and the MP7. Oh, and the JHK, AKM, you know, the 74, the 47 series. And Poseidon does a really good uh, job giving you a detailed installation sheet. This, this is a prototype. I'm not sure if these are available yet, but if, if it is, I will leave a link to it in the description. Yeah, prototype. All right, not many components. All you really have to work, play with is your uh, well, recoil rod, I guess you could call it. Just gotta swap out the springs, add this little buffer. Here's the upgrade spring and here's the stock one. Does seem a little longer. All you're gonna have to do is uh, pop out that pin right there and swap out the springs and add that little buffer to the side. It's gonna be a little difficult to show on camera, but I'm gonna do exactly what I just said and pop out that pin and place all the parts in. I'll give you guys a look. All right, after you popped your little pin out, you're just gonna twist it Pull the little thing out. Don't lose your, don't lose your little pin. And here's the stock spring. Oh, both about the same length in reality. This one does feel a little more sturdy though. Definitely. So that's really it. Just throw it right back on. Let me get those washers. All right, I'm not exactly sure. It came with a little washer. I'm not exactly sure which way the washer is supposed to go. Let's see what's on. Oh. Let's see what's going on. I have to pull that spring down pretty hard. This little washer doesn't really seem to fit anywhere. You know, a little nub doesn't fit through it. Doesn't fit on the rod. So I guess I'm gonna just leave it out and just throw this thing back on like that and just that and throw our uh, little retainers back on there. So just give me a second. All right, now that we got that installed once again, Everything is just as is. I didn't. I didn't include that little washer. That did come with it. Uh, I'm not exactly too sure what it's supposed to be for. It didn't really fit on the rod. So we're just gonna test it out like this. Uh, so let's over head over to the shooting range. All right. So here we go. Got a perfect view of the bolt. Wow. Just pulling it back, you can feel the feel. It's just so much stronger, so much crisper, more crisp, I guess. The MSK. The MSK, the recoil was just kind of all over the place. Sometimes it was crisp and nice, but other times it's kind of just sluggish and sluggish and sloppy. So let's see what this recoil kit's got. Hopefully you can see that. There you go. Wow, put some BBs in there. I'm running out of BBs, but this thing is shooting nice. That was semi-automatic, by the way. 
Let me see if I can put this on the floor. Wow. And with the little Noveski sound amplifier, this thing is just, sounds like a chainsaw. Put that back on safe or semi. Perfect. So upon firing the first shot through the MSK, you can immediately tell the difference the uh, super recoil spring is making compared to the stock one. This was one of the best and cheapest upgrades you can get, in my opinion, for uh, your gas blowback rifle. Very cheap, very simple, and very effective. You get that instant recoil, you get the bolt cycling a lot faster. So this was this was great. Thank you again Poseidon for sending me these parts. If you love, if you like any of these guns or want to see the gameplay, definitely check out my channel. I'm probably going to be filming today getting some gameplay with the MSK, so if you're interested in that, definitely subscribe and uh, stay tuned. Thanks.